Well, well, well. Welcome back to another episode of the Queen's Tales podcast. Well, hello, hello. My name is Peyton 3.0, the EDM vocal sorcerer. And today we have more of an interesting subject. For those of you who don't know me, this is a faux podcast, not a real podcast. It's just a way for me to poke fun at how big the podcast thing has become. And just like being a YouTuber, every celebrity is doing it too. Mom, cat, dog, you know. But anyway, I'm going to bring out the person behind the ultra ego that is Peyton 3.0 and the entire Peyton 3.0 empire, entertainment empire. And that's going to be your truly Peyton James Cross Jr. Why, thank you so much. Now, what I have to bring to you guys today is, you know, every so now and then, when I get a chance to just kind of chill out and get silent and turn off all my electronics and just sit alone quietly, I get to think And then I have the I have these questions that I don't want to talk about to anybody. One of those would be, why the heck have the hackers launch all the nuclear bombs there is to launch, or at least one of them already? You know what I mean? I mean, they've hacked into pretty much everything else. They've hacked into the social medias. They've hacked into literally all these other like jobs systems, these big businesses systems, at least here in America. Like I believe Sony was hit on the shore of Vegas. MGM and all of its properties were hit and I was working at those at that time Caesars was hit on the strip they own a couple a couple of properties down there and it just caused total chaos so <laughs> why the heck has a, a nuclear bomb been able to be hacked? Been able to be hacked into yet? It is just because they're up above and beyond everybody else in the country because they have to be because these are bombs. Once I can end the whole human race, you know what I'm saying? I don't know. It's just food for thought. And it just brings it back that no matter what you're going through in life, that life could end for all of us at any given moment. But it's so hard no matter how great some of us may be at disciplining in 
using our emotions. To not be ruled by them or our current situ situation in the moment. Because like I said, at any time, the nuclear bomb can go off and in all of human life, including the other life that's here on the planet. So, I constantly find my, myself now thinking f of things from that perspective. Even after, after everything that we all as a collective have to face when it comes to the economy, the inflation, Kovisha pandemic. Barely trying to keep our head above the water. Layoffs, you name it. Firings. It's all happening at one time. That none of it actually matters in the grand scheme of things. Because any day now, somebody can find a way to hack themselves into a nuclear plant or wherever the, these bombs are, are located. And they can press a button from their computer at their own home. Let's say they're in the United States. And they're trying to target a nuclear bomb in Russia. And somehow they managed to finally break into it. And just at a touch of a button, they can launch that missile from the comfort of their own home. Because they just want it all to end. Now I want you guys to marinate on that. And that's my two cents. Let's give it up for Peyton James Crow Jr. Please make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share with your friends. Thank you. Now, folks, before I let you get out of here, if you are not an EDM music lover, thank you for coming today. You can learn this thing. But now you can see your way out for my ravers, festival goers, EDM lovers. Stay right here. This this is for you. Go ahead and follow the social medias. But my main focus of importance comes down to the email list. Because at this point in time, email list king, social media is a robotic monster. So the king is reigning. Glorious. So in order to get on the email list, go ahead and get on my website, Peyton30.com. And as a gift for me to you, there's a button on the front page that says get three free unreleased EDM bangers. Okay. And I will see you on the next episode of the Queen's Tale Podcast. Bye-bye.